Warning, the following dish is sweet and delicious. Hello everyone, welcome to our kitchen. Today I'll be sharing with you the sweet and savory dish I've been cooking for over 20 years, the slow braised pork belly. It's full of collagen, which is good for young and old. For this dish, I'm using two pounds of pork belly, one large scallion, few slices of ginger, three star anise, few bay leaves, one Chinese cinnamon stick, about two and a half ounces of uh, crystal sugar, and other ingredients we need are dark soy sauce and Chinese cooking wine. For the pork belly, make sure you choose the ones with uh, good layers of fat and uh, lean meat. Wash it clean, dry it, then cut into inch wide pieces. The inch wide pieces will need about an hour and a half to cook. Smaller pieces can be cooked faster. For this dish, we are going to sear the meat first before putting it into the casserole. So first we are going to heat up the wok, add about a tablespoon of oil, put in the ginger slice first. Then add the pork belly. This is a key step in the cooking. With all sides seared, the lean meat won't lose its juice during the braising. And also, with the seared surface, the meat won't stick to the bottom of the casserole. Be patient about this process. It will take about 3 to 5 minutes to get all sides browned. Once the meats are browned, it's time to add all the spices. Add about 1 to 1 and a half tablespoon of dark soy sauce. Then add 1 to 1 and a half cup of uh, Chinese cooking wine. Using this much of cooking wine to braise the meat will give the meat a very nice fragrance. Stir everything together a little bit. Heat up the liquid before transfer over to the casserole. I'm using a clay pot casserole here. You can use other casseroles or a pot with thick bottom which can distribute the heat evenly during braising. Add additional water to make sure most of the meat are covered. Adjust the position of the meat so most of them can be soaked in the liquid. Finally, put in the scallion before putting on the lid. Keep it on high heat for 15 minutes. Then check the meat, make sure nothing is sticking to the bottom. Then you can add a tablespoon of regular soy sauce for flavor. Then put on the lid, turn to medium heat, and start your timer. You may take a quick peek a couple of times during the braising, but don't open the lid too often. One and a half hours later. With the braising part done, you can check to see that the fatty part of the pork belly become gelatin-like, and the lean part is very tender on the inside. Keep the lid open to thicken the sauce a little bit. At the same time, remove the scallion, star anise, and cinnamon stick. Make sure all the meat get a final glaze of sweet and savory sauce. And then the cooking is done. The meat won't taste fat at all because all the fat are being braised out. When you eat this, take a full bite of the whole piece. The fatty part will melt in your mouth, blend in with the tender lean meat. I hope you will enjoy this slow braised pork. 
Thank you for watching. See you next time.